Hey guys, Max Selfie Queen here, and welcome back to some more of our Pokemon Black randomized Nuzlocke. So, at the end of last episode, we talked to an old lady um, on a route that I can't remember the name of right now, but I know it was just outside of Mistralton City. Um, we just got our 8th gym badge, and I know once you get your 8th gym badge, uh, all the, the Pokemon, the land Pokemon open up, like Landorus, Tornadus, and Thunderous. Um, the roaming Pokemon, the legendaries, they open up after you defeat the 8th gym. And depending on black or white, whatever game you're playing, you have a chance of encountering a Tornadus or Thunderous, I believe it is. Um, and I don't think you can encounter Landorus until you go to this area that we can't reach right now because you need, uh, I believe, Waterfall, which I don't think we have. Um, but anyway, I thought we're nearing the end of the game. And we're probably going to get a few more encounters, probably just maybe one or two. Um, and then we will be ready to face the end of the game and pretty much be done with, the, with it um, all together. So, I figured since we're able to do this now, let's do it right now. And let's go ahead and catch ourselves a free Tornadus. Um, I come to the route that it said there was a storm on. I went into the little bulletin board area. And it said Route 16 had a big storm on it, so we are out at Route 16 right now. And the only thing that I have to do is I just have to run around in the grass until I encounter um, Thunderous or Tornadus. And if I don't encounter him, uh, I'm going to go ahead and reload it and then start over again. Because from what I found out um, by testing this, is that it is... There it is, right there. Okay, good. It is... Um, a one-time chance so you basically want to save right before right when you get on that route with the thunderstorm and then if it doesn't work I'll just restart and till we get the Pokemon and I also heard that they do flee right away um, so we can either play this two ways we could try to use a quick ball on it and, and just kind of save right here and then we'll see if we can catch it with a quick ball or we could just throw our uh, Master Ball at it and um, catch it. In my opinion, I think we should use the Master Ball because this basically is a free Legendary. I thought it was going to be randomized as something else, but turns out it wasn't actually randomized. It's just actually Tornadus. Um, and I figured I could get a free Tornadus here to use um, on the team if we want to use it. Level 40, it's right there with our other Pokemon. We're ready to go. I can put it right on the team now if I want to. Um, and you guys know how I am. I really just love having team teams full of legendary Pokemon. So we've already got a Keldeo. We've already got a Mewtwo. Why not add a Tornadus and possibly another legendary when we have to catch uh, Reshiram. Who probably won't be Reshiram. He'll be randomized to something else. Uh, but I feel like with Reshiram, we might just be able to um, catch it with an Ultra Ball. Because since it's going to be re replaced with something else... I think it still retains Reshiram's catch rate, which is not that bad um, because Reshiram is a box art Pokemon and they want you in the story to actually, um, they want you in the story to actually go ahead and catch it. So I don't know if we would have much trouble with catching the legendary that we get uh, at that point. So I think we are probably just going to throw our Master Ball at it. I know you guys are probably not going to be okay with this, but... I've got it. I'm, I have a chance of getting a Master Ball if I find it like a random item, so I might as well use it. And then if we get another one by chance, then we can just go ahead and use that on our next Legendary. But I wanted a chance to catch this thing because I've actually never done this um, event before. So we caught a uh, Tornadus and uh, it is a flying type Pokemon. I believe we can actually change its forms as well. Um, I don't remember where, I'd probably have to look that up, but as you can see, once you catch it, the Thunderstorm goes away. Um, but I didn't have a Pokemon that had Mean Look or, um, uh, an ability, an ability that had, um, where they couldn't run away, like a Spell Tag or something like that, I think it is, or a Shadow Tag. So I just decided to um, not worry about that one. 
we'll just catch it with the master ball because I didn't want it to run away. They said once you encounter it, it's going to run away. So I tested it out and it did in fact run away. Um, I used a quick fall, it didn't work and it ran away. So I figured we could go ahead and just use our master ball on it. Why not? It's the end of the game. At this point, what does it really matter? Um, it is a flying type, so we could potentially switch it out for Braviary, although Braviary has really put in some work for us. Um, I, I wouldn't be opposed to using a, uh, Tornadus on the team. Oh my gosh, if I could quit hitting the wrong buttons, then that would be great. Okay, so we have caught our... Tornadus here. It is Jolly with Prankster. I'm not sure if that's good or not on Tornadus. Um, I'm assuming it's okay. I don't know. But it has Air Cutter, Revenge, and Extra Sensory. Uh, you know what? I should probably... Let me just look up how to change its forms. Okay. So they are fully capable of being changed. It's done by using the item reveal glass, which is obtained by taking the theory and form landers, the abundant shride, and then you can use items, switch Pokemon between forms. Um, okay. So taking the forms to the abundant shrine, and then when you use that item, it will switch the Pokemon between forms. So we can't go to the Abundant Shrine right now, I believe, so I think I will just go ahead and uh, we will not change its form right now. I don't know if it makes a big difference or not, I'm not actually sure, uh, but like I said, I would really like to use this thing on the team, so let's add another Legendary! Yay! <laughs> I think we will probably replace this guy with... Um, Vanillish, to be honest, because I know it's going to evolve into Vanillux pretty soon. Um, or we could just replace it with Braviary. As much as I really like Braviary, I would love to have a Tornadus on the team. I really would, because we already have two legendaries, so why don't we just make it three? Or we could use, replace it with Durant, to be honest. Um, I might... I might just do like a full overall overhaul with the team um, before we enter the Elite Four or whatever it is that we'll be doing. But I can't. I'm sorry. I cannot resist the opportunity to use a Tornadus. I have never in my life done. Um, I have never done the event for the Tornadus Thunderous thing. So to be able to use it is honestly going to be, in my opinion, something to see. Uh, don't worry if you are upset that I have so many legends. I'm probably going to lose a legend. I mean, it just is probably going to happen. Uh, let's let's actually give this thing the King's Rock. I don't know why I just thought it's there. Let's give it the King's Rock. And you know what? Let's give Keldeo something as well. Um, I have... I think two amulet coins and I want to give somebody an amulet coin because we do need a few um, we do need a few more dollars if we want to pick up some more uh, pokeballs so that was kind of my agenda for today was to catch um, to catch thunderous but I also think we are actually able to go and catch something uh, else now that we can go on this route. I want to check though first um, because there is a route. Actually, I'm probably going to have to go back. Probably going to have to go back. Uh, let me just see here. So if I pull up the map. Let's see. I don't know what I'm doing. I had a whole bunch of stuff that I planned on doing this episode and it's just falling apart. Okay, so if we pull up the map here, you can see that there's an area over here called Route 17 and 18. And this is a place where it is believed to once be, con be con 
contiguous with the desert resort. I don't know what that means, but um, I don't believe we've gotten any Pokemon on these routes yet. On 17 or 18. Uh, because we weren't able to surf. And I don't think I went back to any of the routes. So we're just going to go ahead and check where we caught all of these guys. And if we didn't catch any on Route 16 or um, 17, then I think we should be good. I don't know why those are all saying that they were caught in Nacreen City, but okay. I'm not seeing anything on Route 16 or 17, so let us go do that. I want to get all these encounters pretty much wrapped up today. Because we are, oh, actually, we just got rid of our flyer, so. Probably gonna have to bring Braviary back for right now. Um, but I want to get all our encounters done before we move on, because, like I said, we're, we're pretty much getting back into the end of the game right now. Um, so, we want to get the rest of the encounters that we need. And then we can go ahead and take on, of course, the uh, Elite Four. And I believe we will do all the rest of the story stuff and we should be good to go with finishing up the game. Um, which is my goal, is to get the game finished um, before I start something new, like I always do. Because I have been wanting to start something new for quite a while. I wanted to start a couple of new things, but I figured I would finish a couple of these series before I did that. Um, and one of the series that I wanted to finish up was this one. And then I also, of course, wanted to finish up um, another one as well. I believe I was talking about it uh, in the last recording. Oh, there's trainers out here. Okay. Uh, but basically, I want to finish up this one and another one. And I couldn't think of the other one. And whenever I stopped recording, I finally remembered, of course. Uh, I want to finish this one. And I want to finish Coliseum as well. I have some plans to play... Um, Possibly Pokemon Platinum, maybe Diamond or Pearl, I haven't decided yet, as a wedlock form. But then I also want to play um, a Mystery Dungeon game, so I need to probably finish Black and Coliseum first before I start two new Pokemon series, because I like to keep the channel well-rounded. I like to keep... Uh, the Pokemon series up, but I also would like to do the Apex and then um, Terra, of course, and then we have like To the Moon finished up, and then um, are we on a new route? I cannot see if we're on a new route. We are on Route 1. No, we're not on a new route yet. Okay. Just wanted to make sure. I believe we have to go through like a little... Yeah, we have to go through here to get to a new route. We might... I feel like we've done this. I feel like we have, but I didn't see any Pokemon that were caught on Route 17, so maybe we haven't. If we have, you can let me know, and whatever we catch, we will just not count, I guess. Um, but so far, I don't think we've caught anything, and it is just a level 10 Surskit, um, so I'm going to send a quick ball your way, Surskit, um, and hope that you stay in it because you are just level 10. And then we'll go to Route 18, and we'll catch our last Pokemon that we're able to catch right now. Uh, but yeah, I want to finish up those series before I start a bunch of new stuff, so we are going to do that. Look, why couldn't my encounter have been an Empoleon? That would have been a way better encounter than a Sarskid. Don't get me wrong, Masquerine is pretty cool, but I would have loved to have had a Empoleon versus a Masquerine. Alright, I kind of don't want to fight you, but okay, I guess I have no choice. Um, so now that we've caught Tornadus, we need to catch these last two mons, and then I guess we will probably- I don't know if we'll get time to go into fighting Bianca and Sharon today. Uh, because I believe that is what's coming up next. I'm pretty sure Bianca and Sharon are going to be our next targets that we are going to have to defeat. Really? Um, so I don't know if we'll get a chance to do that yet. But hopefully at some point we'll be able to finish with those guys before we head on to Victory Road. I don't remember in this game 
So, is there a victory road? Because that'll be another encounter as well. I think there's a route leading up to it, so that might be another encounter we can get. I don't know, I haven't really studied the map too hard yet. I've just kind of been playing it by ear, and I've been like, okay, well, we're not going to do this. We'll do the encounters later. Uh, but now that we're towards the end of the game, I figure we might as well go ahead and do these encounters while they're here. Uh, I really don't want to take you on, so I'm just going to avoid you. And then we are still in Route 17, I believe. Uh, it didn't change to Route 18 yet, so... Unfortunately, we can't catch that Snivy, but it would have been nice to have, like I was saying, a Surskit. And, and look at this, a Giratina as well. All these Pokemon would have been really nice to have, other than a Surskit, but that's what we got first. Looks like I should have waited until I come over to the grass. Although, you guys probably would have been really mad at me if I would have... Would you like to receive this egg? Sure! Oh, and we have an egg as well. Okay, well, um, I need to go make some room in my party, but I will come back out here. I just want to get to Route 18. <laughs> really? Because I want to get my encounter. Then we will fly back out here and we will get the egg. So it looks like we're probably not going to take on Sharon or Bianca and get towards the, uh, the Elite Four in this episode. But... We are getting all of our encounters done, which is something that I definitely wanted to do. And that will also mean that I think I will be hatching an egg off screen as well. So that should be fun. Hopefully it'll be- oh, and we, there's Waterfall! So now we can go to the uh, area where we can change the forms of Landorus and Tornadus and Thunderous. Although I don't know if I can get to it this way, or if I have to go a different way to get to it. I'm not really too sure on that. Um, we'll just have to wait and see. I'll have to look that up, of course, off screen because, um, I've already looked up one thing on screen and I don't want to waste any more of you guys' time than I have to. Since we are spending this kind of like a filler episode catching Pokemon. Whoa, a Fion, all right. Although this is good training, I guess. Um, we do need the training. Although I don't think Braviary needs the training. But, you know what, whatever. I just want to get these encounters. Um, we'll go ahead and switch into Crooked Owl for Driftblim. And just use a little crunch. Although I did learn Foul Play, which would be nice to use. I haven't used that yet. Okay, are we any closer to getting to Route 18 yet? Because I would really like the route to change. Any time now would be nice. Um, I don't know which way to go though. I think not that way. If this takes me all the way back to the beginning, I'm gonna be upset. I'm still seeing that it hasn't changed to Route 18, so I'm not sure we are there yet. Ooh, hello. A fossil! Another fossil! So it looks like... I don't actually know where we are, but there's a bunch of stuff here. Actually, there's a computer back there. I could probably... No? Can't do nothing but that. Okay. Um, we're still not on Route 18 yet. I wonder if we can actually get to Route 18 or not? Maybe we can't? I'm not for sure. Or maybe I just went the wrong way? I thought that you could go straight back, but maybe not? Okay, Lopany, calm down here. Calm down. The one time whenever you miss a Air Slash. Not the time to be missing it, Riviere. Not the time to be missing an Air Slash. Okay. Maybe I'll just have to check the map again? Oh my gosh, we are... Apparently we are in Team Plasma's secret lab. Located in a little quiet island. And I don't know, have we got an encounter yet? I think we just killed our encounter. I think we did. 
Yeah. Uh, I don't. It didn't show up though as a route change, so I don't think it would count. Either way, I think we went the wrong way. So we need to go back. We're forwards? Are we right back at the beginning? I feel like we're right back at the beginning. Oh my gosh, this is annoying. Kinda would rather just not do this. Um, I'm not really sure where to go. I probably should put up a repel as well. It would probably make things a lot quicker. Uh, but we did get waterfall. I think that's kind of worth. It's very worth it to get waterfall. And I believe I'm supposed to go this way. I believe so. I'm not sure. Um, I need to get... Oh my gosh, really? I didn't want to do all these battles, to be honest. I think we should probably just head on towards the next route, though, to the Elite Four area. Uh, I wasn't too concerned about getting these encounters. It's not like it really matters. We have tons of um, Pokemon in the PC. We have a full team. We're good to go. We're not struggling like we were at the very beginning of the game. Which is good. I'm glad we aren't struggling. Um, but we do need to come back and get that egg, though. Maybe we can't go through unless we have strength. Which, I mean, I could teach to Braviary if it can learn it. Because strength isn't a bad mood to have. I would like to teach Waterfall as well. Yeah, Braviary can learn it, so... Might as well. It's probably going to be better off than Slash. I mean, I know Slash has a good high crit ratio. Let's actually see... Nobody can learn Waterfall anyway. Uh, but I want this encounter. I, I've spent all this time coming out here. I'm going to get the encounter now. And if this just leads to nowhere, then I'm going to be mad that I taught Strength to Braviary for no reason whatsoever. Um, It might have. Yeah, it just led to an item. Wow! That's kind of annoying. Oh well, either way, I think we need Strength anyway. To do this last part um, towards the Elite Four stuff, I think you need strength. So, might as well come out here and do this anyway. Maybe we just can't get to Route 18. Maybe it's something you have to do with uh, the Desert Resort because it did say something about the Desert Resort. I just, um, that it, this, it kind of connects to it. I have no idea what it was talking about. Um, on the map, but if you're guarding an item, it better be a good one. A leaf stone. Okay, well, uh, that's alright, I guess. Yeah, there's nowhere we can go out here. It's blocked off by the rocks. And on the map, it actually shows. Oh, we are on route to 18? Well,. It didn't show me we were on our Route 18. Alright, well, looks like we forfeited that encounter as well. That's just great. Get me out of here. We gotta fly back to a town with a PC right now. Okay, so we need to deposit a Pokemon so we can go get that egg. Um, so let's go ahead and deposit Crocodile for a second. And we will go back to Route 17, and we will go get the egg. So at least it wasn't a complete loss. Like, yeah, we got to Route 17, and we caught a Surskit, and we were on Route 18, and I just didn't realize it. Um, but at least we get a free egg, so maybe the egg will turn out to be something good. Who knows? All I know is I got, I, I'm going this far. I might as well get the egg. We're here. Let's just do it. Okay, so the route might have changed, and I just didn't realize it, but it did change when we got to Route 17, so I figured it would have changed when we got to Route 18. Because right when we go through here, it says Route 17, but it never shows up Route 18. Weird. Alright, so for some reason I want to see if you will give me something, because you're just standing here, but it 
You just want to battle? Okay, fine. Um, we're gonna switch out here for an Umbreon because... Ooh, Pursuit! Ouch! Don't do that, Umbreon. That's going to hurt. You know, one thing that I have seen here is that Keldeo... Isn't Keldeo one of the legendary, like, um... Rios? Isn't it with the trio? Like... Verizion, Cobalion, and Verzion. Um, but it doesn't have Sacred Sword. Is there something I'm missing here? Or was it supposed to have Sacred Sword and it just didn't have it? Or what? Because I would really like to have Sacred Sword. I think it would do way better than Double Kick. Because I know Cobalion, Verizion, and um, Brachion and all those, they have Sacred Sword. So... Why wouldn't uh, Keldeo have it? Hm. Weird. Maybe I need to go to like a, a move relearner place. Maybe I'll be able to learn Sacred Sword. I don't know. That might be something I need to check out off screen as well. Because we want to be prepared for these upcoming battles. Um, so I think today we are going to be good after we get our egg here. Um, I didn't have very much more planned to do today uh, other than this. So this is going to be it. I think I'm going to go ahead and fly back though because we are going to need to be in this area next episode uh, in Opelucid City because we're going to get ready to go where we need to go. Um, so, I think we're going to go ahead and end off the episode here. We have been going on for almost 30 minutes now anyway. I've probably been rambling non-stop. Uh, but I wanted to go ahead and do that though. I wanted to get the um, encounters that we had left over. Because I figured that would be something that uh, we could do. And then um, I also wanted to... Oh, actually, you know what? You can stay there for just a little bit while we hatch this egg. Uh, I'll see if it hatches here while we go ahead and um, finish up this episode. I'll just drive back and forth here on the bike and we'll see what happens. Uh, but I think that is going to probably do it for this episode. Um, I'm going to continue to try to hatch the egg off screen. And then next time, I think we will start heading up towards the next route. We've already caught our next route encounter, though. Um, so we won't need to catch it. But we will need to go, and I believe this is the big Charon and Bianca fight, which will be, I think, the last time that we take them on. And then we'll head to the next routes, which will be our Victory Road area, and pretty much get finished with the game. So this was kind of, like I said earlier, this was a little bit of a filler episode. Because I wanted to catch Thunderous, or not Thunderous, Tornadus, um, while we were able to do it now. And then I wanted to catch those encounters that we had left over that we weren't able to do. And of course, we got Waterfall now, which is good. Um, and we should be able to use it. So I will probably look up off screen where I can change the forms at in that, um, I think it said Resilient Cave or something? Resilient Cave? I don't remember the name of it, but... I'll probably try to change Thunderous's form as well. Tornadus. Oh my gosh, why do I keep getting Thunderous and Tornadus mixed up so badly? Ugh. Anyway, I'll try to change its form off screen as well. Actually, I don't know. Do I want to do it off screen or do I not want to do it? Because we're going to get an encounter in that area too. So... I don't know. I haven't decided what I want to do for the next episode yet. I think it's just going to to be all determined on whether I can go th to this area or not and change its form. If I can't, then we will continue on next episode uh, getting heading towards the, uh, the league. If I can, then we will go there, I guess, next episode and we'll have another like mini filler episode, possibly, um, of getting our next encounter and then changing our form on our Pokemon. Uh, but it doesn't look like my rambling is helping. I don't think our egg is going to be hatching. I have to do that off screen. Uh, it looks like it would take a long time to hatch. So possibly, possibly we could have a legendary in our egg. Who knows? 
Um, but that's gonna have to wait until later. Uh, because we're gonna end off now, and I guess I will see you guys in the next episode of our Pokemon Black Randomized Nuzlocke.